Hey everyone, Kyle once again, and welcome back to the next um, pre the next preview discussion for Yashihime Season 2, Episode uh, 19, titled The Blackout. So, as, as for the previous episode, our three heroes, uh, they've now jumped back through, the, jumped into the windmill of time, heading back into the future, along with Akiru, cool, uh, that was cool enough, he, jumped to, he jumps in with them. And along with Kitty, Mario, and Ryo, who he makes it just in time, just before he burns the uh, windmill. So that's not a good thing. And after 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 which um he went in, all these other demons starts pouring out of it now. So, but uh, but now I uh, get into the, get into the preview at hand here. So, so now that the girls are back in the in the, back in the future, it opens up with um uh, like with Setsuna wearing like this long uh like this long trench coat, and uh. This, this long gray trench coat with her weapon covered up, you know, and she's looking a little bit like it, um, has a little bit embarrassed look on her face as she has to wear a certain, like, a, a certain attire, right? So, yeah, has a little embarrassed look on her face, which is kind of funny. Or cute, too. And then you have Moroha wearing, like, a, a pink one covering over her, over her outfit with her, uh, bow and arrow covered up as well. And, uh, like, uh, like I think it was, like, I think it's like, uh, was it Moroha? Were back? It was uh, I think it was Moroha who were, was uh, going back in. Who was like? Oh no! I think that was Toa. It's Toa. She's like happy as a present day. I'm back, and he's like hope. Gra hope Grandpa is doing well. Like you know, Kagome's um, Kagome's uh, grandfather. So technically, it would be uh, her great grandfather, but she's called a grandpa. So, and then we cut back with with Osamu Kirin. Um, who was like all these looking at all these pods, and we see the return. Um, we see the return of uh, these these toad uh, these toad demons, which we've seen before in the past in in Inuyasha. Like they uh, they blow out these like these certain bubbles out of their mouths, and they trap the person inside. Yeah, it ha happened. I saw it happened in one episode back in the early seasons of Inuyasha, and then another one, I believe, in season four where. They were helping. They were. They were, they were assisting this uh, half. This half demon, which a, ha a human transforms into that bull, ha a bull demon, and they were. Uh, they were used to make. They were making like fake Shikon jewels. Well, you see that one toad demon in there trapping our friends, Kagome and the friends. So yeah, we see the return of these guys again. So all these pods. It looks like some like all these people. I assume like all these people they captured. And Osamu Kirin is there with them. Is there is there, and Toa saying that we have to we have to find Mr. Kirin too, and we see um, Osama Kirin using his hands currently to use some of his powers again, and then and they're just saying wait why are all so many why are the why are there so many demons over here, so, so they say that all the, so they say the demons have crossed over into the into the future as well like how with Osama Kirin took out those demon crows from earlier, some of them are spewing out into the future now. And we see Moroha and Cessna jumping on from roof from roof to roof. Um, uh, especially on especially on the, on the school, the Saint Gabriel school where uh, Toa goes to. And then we see uh, we see Toa holding a ta holding a tablet, which shows um, the the next concert, which um, his adoptive his adoptive mother uh, Moi, uh, is going to be playing there. You know, because since she's a violinist, so. The, the, her next concert uh, starts, I think it's tonight, and we see the big stadium, the big stadium where she's, where she's playing at, and it's saying, uh, welcome home, Toa, will you be a part of mom's concert, and we see her playing. So it looks like there's going to be a lot of, uh, hopefully maybe there's going to be like chaos now in the future, now that demons are going to be in the future now. But like I say, is it's Osama, it's Osama Kieran going to be a good guy? I don't know yet, but... Um, we see that we so we see her. Then we see uh, these other demons, uh, like sort of like I don't know what kind of demons they look. They look, they look, they look like they have multiple eyes. So, and then we see Osama Kieran in a crowd, and then ends with our three, uh, our trio on the roof on the rooftop of the school, assuming that they're talking to Osama Kieran. Yeah, so assuming they're talking to Osama Kieran on the roof, maybe. But yeah, but I'm saying, is he? But is he gonna be a good guy though? Because he, even though he helped with the, just destroy those demon crows though, and he said he was begging like Kiryu Mario to save the hum, uh, the world and the humans. So I don't know. 
We'll have to see. We'll see about that though. So, but the, but the next episode is called the Blackout, and so uh, they have to. Um, like I said, uh, Toa's adoptive mother Moy is play, is playing at the concert. Her violin, because she because she's a concert violinist. So, so yeah. Well, this could be another really good episode. Like I said, I wish that Kagome and Inuyasha will go. Well, well, I want. I would love to see them go back to the future and see Kagome's family again for all times. But thing is though. Uh, it looks like we're not going to get that, though. But I think it's better because cause all the demons are spewing out of the windmill in back in the feudal era. So I guess they're going to have the hands full. Because they have uh, Moroku, Sango, with the black Hirai goats. Um, and then... Um, and then uh, and Kohaku and Hisui with, with that others that the original sword that Toa had. So they're all gonna, I guess they're all going to be fighting those demons that's in, in that, back in that world, so... Yeah, those are gonna be, it's gonna be quite a handful. So in the next episode, so looking forward to seeing it. So yeah, that's my uh, so that's my quick preview discussion of the next preview of episode nineteen, the blackout. Looking, no, let's say it, looking forward to it. And also that now that uh, Kitty Maru is now in, is is traveling to the future with them, along with Rion, because he wanted to take her with him to see that world. And Akiru, Akiru is with them as well, so it's just nice to see too. So, but yeah, another looking forward to looking forward to the next episode. Looks like it'll be pretty good as well. Thanks for watching. Stay tuned for the next episode review. By this time, yeah, the next episode review for um, the Genius Prince's Guide to Raising a Nation Out of Debt. Later.